have a few areas to talk about in the Western Pacific here on our Sunday night heading into Monday morning. Before I get into the update though, be sure to check out our Patreon. Link is down below or at least hit that like and subscribe button. All these things really help out the channel. So I'll just leave it at that. Anyways, let's talk about this. So we still have this uh, monsoonal gyre with the southwest monsoon off the west coast of the Philippines and even surging in some moisture from a tropical wave off towards the east. This is bringing some passing showers, even localized flooding in southern Luzon over towards Visayas. Also showers in Yap, Palau, and all this is going to surge towards the north as we look ahead into places like Hong Kong over towards Hainan and in also into Vietnam. Now, do you want to note though, it almost feels like an upper level low off the coast of Mindoro. This is helping increase instability here uh, as well. You can see kind of the broad rotation over the last 12 hours. Now, uh, this is not going to form into anything, but as I mentioned, it is increasing that instability. So we're seeing that additional scattered showers. Watch this as we go ahead through our Sunday afternoon, even around Manila. Look at that storm blowing up right over Cavite, parts of Region 1 all the way down towards Mindoro and the western areas of Visayas. So there's that additional instability we're continuing to monitor. And if we look ahead through our day here on our Sunday night, well, already passing, uh, those showers that popped up. Now we're going to go ahead on the Monday. Additional instability with afternoon showers along the west coast of the Philippines and you're also still seeing that moisture surge into places like Hong Kong going to see an increase in showers out there not a terrible flooding rain type of event but definitely going to see a slight increase in that precip plus we're still seeing that surge of moisture coming in from the east too some additional showers and instability across the uh, Philippines so kind of a one-two punch here with that easterly flow and the southwest monsoon still in play which by the way I just put out a whole separate video about what the south West Monsoon is, be sure to check out our Westpac Weather 1 playlist or just uh, on this channel, the latest video here as well. Uh, basically though, this does take place often between June and September, so it's late June, not unheard of out here. You have that southwesterly flow, which sometimes can cause local flooding when we get that enhanced habaga going on. Uh, 2012 and 2013, actually a pretty good case of that uh, from Haikui and Maring uh, as well. So this year, not quite as bad as that, but it just kind of shows you, you know, that monsoonal flow does bring those showers. And that's what we're also seeing here as we go ahead through our day on Monday. Even places like Cebu might see some rain, but I think the heavier stuff is going to be along the west coast of Mindoro. Uh, extending back towards places like Subic, extending into uh, Baguio, Ohio, higher elevation, and even in parts of uh, Region 2 uh, as well. So it's the wet season. No, uh, no surprise there in that forecast. Does make for some beautiful sunrises and sunsets. Eve sent this in. Uh, absolutely fantastic photo. If you guys have any photos of sunrises and sunsets, please share them with me at uh, my Facebook page, Robert Spetta weather. All right, so broader picture, Hanoi, of course, showers there for you with our flow coming in at low Manila as well. You're gonna be looking at scattered showers and thunderstorms. Oh, wow, copy and paste the forecast actually over the next few days, 32 for the high and afternoon thunderstorms in your forecast. I'm not, uh, not surprised one bit by that here uh, as well. Let's actually just scoot this ahead. We look at the uh, sunrise and sunset. Not sure why that froze up there, but there you go. Sunrise, sunset, 528 a.m. Sunset's going to be at 629. And don't forget, it's still that full strawberry moon ongoing anywhere in the world. So if you got a photo of that, please share it with me as well. And you look at the word into Cebu, there is that chance of those showers there on your Monday, a high of about 32 degrees. Um, yeah, Ooh, look at Hong Kong. I mentioned you guys because you still have that inflow, which we thought might be a monsoonal kind of gyre type of storm. It looks like guidance backed off, but you're still going to see those showers out here uh, as well. And the Climate Prediction Center, just by the way, still expecting from the 3rd over towards the 9th, a possible storm developing somewhere around the Philippine or West Philippine uh, Sea uh, on top of all that. So, yeah, that's a look at what's happening out there. As I mentioned at the beginning of the update, uh, if you want to support this channel, check out our Patreon. Link is down below. These are everybody who donate at least $10 a month, uh, especially these fantastic people even donate more than that. You guys are all legends. And um, like I said, I'll never put it behind a paywall. I've said that in every update. But if you ever thought, you know, wow, he Rob does put a lot of effort into these updates and a lot of money as well because uh, this is not free to make these graphics. You want to support the channel, just check it out. That's all I can ask. Anyways, that's all for today. If you have any questions, comments, or suggestions, please let me know. Number one thing, as always, of course, is stay safe out there, friends. Hope you're having a good day, wherever you are.